think one thing I want to say is I've been making artwork my whole life and I when I was a teenager I went to art school and then um, like I really took it to the next level doing that and I'm not saying you have to go to art school but um, from there I graduated art school and just my whole life from that point on was sort of the steady output of creative projects, paintings, drawings, designs for myself, for others. And I'm now 49 and my point of this video is to say if you want a creative life uh, to follow that art path, you can. You can do it and you can thrive and if that's what you want you can 100% have that thing and it shifts just be aware it shifts and it doesn't always look one way sometimes it might look like galleries or museums or it might look like video games websites, books, um, it changes, it shifts, so as long as you remain open and flexible to how you share your creativity, I think you could have a really long, happy, full life making stuff for yourself as well as others. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to put my story out there to maybe give you guys some hope that if you're newer to this path, don't give up. Shift and grow and, and just be open to changes. I mean, like for myself right now, I used to show in galleries a lot and I don't anymore and that's okay. I didn't stop making paintings because of it. I have a whole wall filled with a body of work that I'm making for myself. And I have other things that I've made for myself. As well as others, the collectors, private collectors. A gallery is not the only path, is what I'm saying. There are multiple ways that you can go about being creative in this world. I think first and foremost, it should be for yourself, for your, from your heart, for yourself, to give your life fulfillment. And to also leave yourself to others, like give yourself to others with your creativity and your truth. And it's possible. So, Hang in there, keep at it, you're doing great.